there are one or two places of interest nearby. I could tell you more about them if you like, Master. My apologies. I have a request, if you're of a mind to hear it. Ah, it is you. I suppose I should thank you. to remain here. As a matter of fact, have you always pursued your current vocation over the course of your journey with your... I suppose I should thank you. This is for you. Now... Whoever said foraging was unseemly. Never knew a day of hard travel. Our bellies will last a little longer. I seem to recall there being a treasure chest in this area when I explored it in other worlds. Shall I lead the way?
allow ourselves to become complacent. Take each trial as it comes. Right. And it looks as if it could bear a significant load. Might we not avail ourselves of its use? Interest nearby. I can tell you more about them if you like, Master.
Avoid flame at any cost to risen. You have been doused in oil. I shan't allow any further harm to come to you. I'm sure we'll find a purpose for it in due time. me today. Oh, very well. Back to your side I go. I'll pick that up. We might have need of it. I would so enjoy seeing this obstacle smashed to pieces. I can attack if need be. It seems they bear us ill will. The power of lightning is terrible to the whole.
Curatives are our best bet when we have no mage to rely upon. Not like a feast to get you ready for bed. Good sleep is the key to a good adventure. In traversing other worlds, I came to no sense letting the enemy gain the upper hand. Early gripping gets the world. I suppose we cannot expect sunshine to follow us wherever we journey. Grumbling isn't like to improve our situation, you know.
Over here. Materials, eh? I shan't deny. They have their uses. Most impressive, Master. Fight on, and victory shall be ours. Resounding success. Let us try for the same result with our next attack. I've heard a blacksmith of singular skill residing by the charge. Perhaps you can take a little bit of If you would be so kind as to follow me, I shall take you to the one who The guide is most welcome. Now we shan't lose our way. that ox carts were a bit safer and a bit swifter too they are capable allies on journeys near and far got any tales to liven up my day This ladder can take us to new heights. Ah, oh, excellent find. If tis a blacksmith you need, I can't help you. I'm retired, see? Oh ho! Tis a regalia sword you want restored, is it? That's a first. <laughs> All right, give us a look then. Hmm. Now here's a masterwork of craftsmanship if I hear saw one. Not to blow my own horn, but uh, I wager I'm the only blacksmith who could set this ailing steel to rights. But, as I've said, I've lain down my tools, and before you start begging, know that I don't intend to pick them back up. Well, why are you still standing there? Leave an old man in peace. That went rather poorly, I fear. What are we to do now? Beg pardon, sir, but uh, I couldn't help overhearing your conversation with Brocker. You'll have to forgive him. He's been in a foul mood ever eh, since we got cut off from the fuel for our forge. Though, he's always been a bit crotchety, come to think of it. Enough cheek, you wool-brained wastrel! 
Now, I'm off to the tavern. Can I count on you to mind things here while I'm gone? Of course you can. You go enjoy yourself. Psst. Hang about, eh? When he's gone, you and I can talk. Twas till the monsters settled in, that is. Neither of us can go anywhere near the place now. Listen, Brock is too proud to ask for help, but I'm not. Would you be willing to go out to the cavern and mine us up some glimmer coal? I'll take as much as you can carry. Should you succeed, I reckon he'll change his mind about restoring that blade of yours. Now, true to its name, Glimmer coal emits a pale light. So you'll want to cast your eyes about for any glowing spots when you get to the cavern. Oh, suppose you'll be needing the name of the place. <laughs> Digger's Ruins, tis called. I'll count on you to bring lots of the stuff back. If we can procure some glimmer coal. If you can bring us some glimmer coal, we'll be able to rekindle the fire in the forge. And the one in old Brockers. As I've said, Glimmer so you'll want to cast your eyes at Digger's Ruins. That's the name of the place. I'd be Look around if you must, but be sure to buy one. Would you mind coming over here? will have to do. Incidentally. was well thought. There's no one standing who might say otherwise. No doubt this triumph will spur us into the next. <sighs> Tis in caverns such as these that monsters thrive. Narrow passages may await us. Be on your guard. Of course. There are one or two places of interest nearby. I could tell you more about them if you like, Master. Give me a 
not faulty powers. Could say the creature was carrying something. Prison. Hmm, without a mage among our ranks, we've no one to heal us in times of need. Battle may be trying without someone to cure our wounds. But for now, we shall just have to manage. The streets of Bagbatal no longer seem so foreign. I still remember my first glimpse of the fire fair. Someday I hope to see stronger ties forged twixt Batal and Vermont. It would be to the benefit of both nations. We should be able to move this boulder with our combined hands. Would anyone care to push? are our best bet when we have been made to be alive. Incidentally,
Water is nigh invisible in this gloom. No few times has an overconfident step soaked my boots. Ah, yes. That sounds familiar. Over here, if you please. Following along, I trust. Take care not to lose sight of me. Wish me to return at once, Master. <sighs> you haven't forgotten us, have you, Master? two places of interest nearby. I could tell you more about them if you like, Master. It is rather high. It might be beyond our reach. Leave this to me, Master. I'll see us through. Shall I assist? During my travels beyond the rift, I learned of a cave near here that you have yet to explore. Shall I take us there? Hobgoblin! Yeah. 
You're back. Have you any glimmer call for me? That's plenty. Many thanks. Glimmer call. Now we can reignite the forge. Tisn't the forge what needs igniting, girl, but your fool ears. I've told you my smithing days ended when those monsters moved in. I've no use for glimmer coal anymore. I'm done. Understand? I'll not hear another word about that rusted hunk of steel. If you're so keen to have it repaired, then see to it yourself. Oh, leave me be. My mattress beckons. Oh, I was certain he'd pick up his tools again if we only had more glimmer coal. My apologies for putting you to all that trouble, sir, but mayhap your efforts needn't go to waste. I could try my hand at repairing that sword for you, if you'd be agreeable. Way I see it, if old Brock is the only smith with the skill to see it done, then I'm your best hope, being as I'm his apprentice and all. Well, what say you? I'm grateful for your trust, sir. You'll soon see your faith was well placed. Um, mayhap not soon as twere. I fear I'm a novice in the truest sense. I'll be needing some time. But I'll see it done all the same. You have my word. Mark me. This blade will be shining like a star by the time I'm finished with it. Sir Sara is apprenticed to the legendary dwarven blacksmith. There's no doubt in my mind that she will succeed. We might be able to slip into the Forbidden Magic Research Lab through the rear entrance. Then follow me. I'll lead the way. The guide is most welcome. Now we shan't lose our way. Just tell me what you need, and I'll see it done. Can't put a price on quality. 
Come again when you've more coin. Nothing makes me so happy as perfecting a new hue. Look as long as you please. Business has been better, but I shan't complain. Do come again. I do so enjoy stocking up on supplies. The longer the journey, the more supplies we'll require. Right you are. Shall we get some rest then? Tis a perilous journey I've had arisen. When that griffin came upon us, I feared we were done for. I feel refreshed and ready for a new day. Off we go then. Feeling rested, I trust? An ox cart ought to make our journey easier. Walking everywhere is certainly tiring. Craftsmanship. How'd they work such a pattern into the blade? Hi there, Arisen. Forgive me, but I've made nary a lick of progress toward restoring that sword of yours. The blade's make is as intricate as tis beautiful. Suppose that's why these things ne'er see battle, eh? If I only knew how to create this pattern on the steel, mayhap the rest had come easier. What are you jabbering about now? Oh, um... Uh, you're looking at the work of a blaze hammer. Tis a process scarce employed, but one befitting the prestige of a regalia sword. Honestly, girl, you're no apprentice of mine if you can't figure out aught as simple as that. Sorry, Brocker. Must have slipped my mind. But if these patterns were the work of a blaze hammer, mayhap that's what it'd take to fix the blade. If you've not heard the term, tis where you heat your hammer to extreme temperatures by dipping it in magma. Tis hardly air used since the hammers like to cool afore you can forge aught with it. Brock has explained the process to me, but I wonder if that's enough. It seems to take a rather complex process to restore the sword, but I've no doubt that Sarah is up to the task. You have my support. Knowing that the patterns on the sword were the work of a blaze hammer complicates matters somewhat. Suppose I'll sleep on it. Mayhap the answer will come to me on the morrow. How could that whelp fail to recognize the distinctive traces of a blaze hammer? I ah, yeah, but it's what she does next that really counts.
a customer then. That changes things. For all in particular. Please hold well. This place fills me with unbidden remembrances. I won't seek your company, but nor shall I spurn it. I have a request to make of you. Interested? For what it's worth, thanks. we need to deliver, do we not? Let us find the intended recipient. We ought to make the delivery now, lest it should end up lost or misplaced. You have my support. This is generally used as a material. Different combinations of materials result in different creations. We might be able to slip into the Forbidden Magic Research Lab through the rear entrance. Pray, allow me to show you the way. Much obliged. That was a skillful bit of thievery. You do your vocation proud. <laughs> 